You know, you gotta, you gotta know what's up, XD. Know what's up. Know what's up. You gotta get the drop on the enemy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You know exactly what's up. <clears throat> I don't know where I'm going, actually. I'm quite lost. Excuse me, sir. Violence is very frowned upon. Um, I appear to be... I appear to be getting shot. I appear to be severely wounded and should uh, seek medical attention. So we are getting absolutely hammered. I probably joined in on the worst game of my life. But either way, holy shit. Well, you know, if one thing was gonna settle my claims, it would have been that, you know? Holy crap. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, that was... Not one of my best games, I'll admit. I'm on fire. I appear to be burning to death. So I, I did actually have a, a reason for recording this, believe it or not. I want to talk about videos. Videos and how often they'll be coming out. And I wanted to point out that video- I, I need to turn down my goddamn volume, seriously, this is too loud. I need to point out that videos will probably be coming out uh, not at all for the next few days, uh, maybe even the next week or two. I have tests coming up, and that's gonna be a whole a whole bunch of fun for the whole family. I'm not gonna enjoy it, but I need to study for it. It's mandatory. Like I'm not gonna be able to do things properly. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna fail shit if I don't study for it. So you know you can see why I find this pretty important. You know. And he just got fucking roasted, my man. Yeah, videos will not be coming out for a while, I can imagine. I don't know when I'll start getting back into gear again, but hey, you'll know, alright? You will know. Once I start uploading all of this well, you know? So don't, don't you worry about me, don't you worry about videos. They'll be coming back very soon. I'm not very good at this game. I probably didn't pick the best game to play right now, but this is more of an arcade game. And I'm able to focus more on talking than actual strategic stuff. Like, if I were playing CSGO, I wouldn't be able to do that. I'd be too busy focusing on the actual game. And you need to get out of my house. What is up with that medic? Seriously. <laughs> His mouse is so broken. <laughs> Wait, is this is this guy spinbotting? I swear to god, if this guy is actually spin-botting in a fucking Team Fortress 2 game. There's other stuff I want to talk about. Oh yes, of course! Mental aware- Mental Health Awareness Week. Yes, that's very important. I- I haven't really gotten a chance to make a video on that. By the time I found out that it was a thing that was happening, there were only like two days left, and let's face it, I can't really develop much more on the points that other YouTubers have already made. Just try and stay positive. There is always someone out there to talk to, you know? I mean, I've never been through any kind of serious mental health issue, but I feel really bad for those who have. I can only... I, hell, I can't even imagine what kind of shit they must be going through, you know? For them to... Like, some people end up suicidal just because of some people being dicks, you know, bullying and all that. And, you know, I've got my own bullies, you know? Yeah, I'm not... I'm not just overly confident for the fucking heck of it. You, you don't don't act like I don't get bullied. It happens all the time. In fact, sometimes I get bullied for my overconfidence. Um, but I just I just roll with the punches, you know. Um, but I know there's some people where stuff like that it's far easier said than done. And you do just need to open up to people, and you need to find someone who you can talk to. Um, I'll probably be putting links in the description as compensation, you know. I'll be putting links in the description for videos from other YouTubers who really knew what they were talking about. I'm honestly not your best source for information. But I will say this, you you do, you need to find someone to talk to. I've... The, the main reason that I, I'm doing as well as I am is because I've talked to people and, you know, they've helped me out. And I can, I can only thank them for that. There are a lot of people I know who have helped me through a lot of really bad shit in life. And it, it is, it is just, it's important, you know? It, it's a human necessity to be able to communicate your feelings to someone, no matter how good or bad they may be, you know? You like to talk about things that make you happy, and you like to 
talk about things that are bad to get it off your chest, you know? If you just hold it all bottled up in your head, you're not going to get better. In fact, it's probably going to do far more damage to you than to anybody else. Don't feel like you're like disappointing someone or bothering them or giving them some sort of grief just by telling them about your problems. Don't expect them to be superheroes either, because nobody's perfect, alright? I mean, you can always talk to people, absolutely, and whether they listen or not, it'll just feel good that you said it to someone. But don't expect it to be a, like some sort of magician. Emotions are a really complicated thing, and we don't always have the answer. I'm like, I love listening to people talk about how they feel, be it good or bad, because I know that I'm, I'm helping them get it off their chest. They're feeling a lot better as a result of it, and that actually in turn makes me feel better. So quite frankly, the effect that some people expect to have on others, it's the complete opposite for me. I love talking to people and, you know, helping them solve issues in their head, but Again, like, I'm only human, I can only do so much, you know? Either way, that was that was the main stuff I wanted to talk about. I mainly wanted to talk about, you know, videos are going to be delayed for the next few weeks because of tests and exams and all that that I have coming up. And, you know, stay positive. Stay positive, talk to people, and trust me, it will make, like, such a massive difference. I know it's been pretty much a ramble video, which is unlike stuff I've normally done, but I think it's a nice little change of pace, you know? I've been making a lot of videos, a lot of planned videos, you know? Stuff like the Minecraft series and all that, and um, tutorial videos are starting to come into play now, and I'm actually quite enjoying making those. So I'm definitely going to continue making them. But yeah, it seems to be getting a lot of support as well. And I can imagine I can grow quite the audience by teaching people how to do cool stuff on YouTube. I'm not sure what else to talk about, honestly, because again, ramble videos, like, they are the least planned thing ever. But I like, I like being casual, I like just talking. Quite frankly, one of the reasons I started the Minecraft series was for the sake of, you know, just being able to ramble and just talk about whatever the hell I felt like talking about. Because again, it, it, ha it has a whole sense of like getting stuff off your chest and all that. Of course, there's nothing that I particularly felt bad about. Um, all I really need to say was that videos are going to be gone for a while, but you know, all's good. Um, my channel trailer has gotten a lot of support recently, and I'm very happy with that. I upload that on Vidme as well, something I should definitely talk about in this video. I have a Vidme account. If you guys haven't followed that already, please do. Um, if I'm to get verified and start uploading videos the same length as I would on YouTube, I do need to be verified and that requires me to get at least 50 followers. So if you guys want to see Vidme ports of my videos, then definitely go check that out. Also, I feel like Vid Vidme has a really amazing community. Um, I mentioned it in videos in the past, but the Vidme community is just awesome. The creators and even the guys who work there, they they seem to be legitimately nice people. Um, and you don't really see the kind of honesty and openness in many on YouTube anymore. Um, it's, it's more so, you know, clickbaiting and, uh, and begging for views and likes and all that. You don't really see that in Vidme, it's just, you just talk. You just talk, you make a little funny video here and there. It's it's my kind of style, you know? And overall, I just think Vidme, in general, is a nice website. Um, for more reasons than just the community. I could go on about the community for hours, but it's not just because of it. I do legitimately think that Vidme is a nice platform uh, for content creators, uh, big or small, really. Mainly small ones because, again, Vidme is a small site, and it's a good place to get started and to get growing, and... Some of the larger YouTubers who have come onto the site recently have actually been trying to help smaller YouTubers, um, you know, get their footing in and get their name heard and all that. And I find that I find that really cool. I think it's uh, really generous of people to be doing stuff like that. Yeah, I have a Vidme account, and that's pretty sweet. And if you guys want to go follow it, please, please, I, I, I would really appreciate it. Every little follow counts and it'll help me towards being able to get verified and be able to do all that cool stuff on Vidme that I wouldn't be able to do otherwise. I also heard that, you know, I, I, I give Vidme credit here because they've been holding out through a lot as it is at the moment. They will be um, quite dramatically 
uh, withholding the amount of um, the amount of video that you can upload in the span of a week. And looking at the rates, I may only be able to upload once a week on VidMe if that cap ends up getting put on me. So I'm going to, and this is only for people who aren't verified by the way. My videos tend to be uh, 800 megabytes to a full gigabyte. And anything over a gigabyte, I can't upload to VidMe. Once this change takes place, I'm pretty sure it's like... Uh, like, you can only upload half a gig to VidMe. So that, that, that verification is going to be pretty necessary, because otherwise I'm going to have to re-render my videos... Uh, like, I'm going to have to re-render my video a second time in far lower quality for the purposes of VidMe, and I really don't want to do that, because I don't want to make it seem like I'm only providing VidMe with lower content. I want it to be equal to the content I produce on YouTube. Anyways, that is all I really wanted to talk about. I've been recording for like 50 minutes now. That's really all that was necessary. I got all I need to say out. Um, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening to the little ramble video. If you like them, it... like them? I don't know. Like them? Upvote? I'll be putting this on Vidme probably as well. And um, yeah. <laughs> See you guys.